Alright then, welcome back. Uh, so today I've decided to go without uh, a bit of a music intro um, because I want to see how it looks without the music. A uh, bit of a bold, brash, lead music instead. So, uh, welcome back as well, as I said. Uh, we've only played the one game since the last episode. 2-1 uh, win over uh, Chester there. Uh, they scored in the like, 92nd, 93rd minute. Nothing crazy, so it was alright. Uh, today then we're going to be playing Brackley. And then we're going to be playing Bamber Bridge in the FA Cup third qualifying round. The team that we're going to be taking out today is going to be Palmer in goal. Because Will Mannion, Mannion has decided to get injured in the last match. Although he was only out for one or two days, I think. So it's not a big problem. Uh, in front of Palmer then we've got Dutton, Reese Williams, Lowe and Moyo. Uh, we've got Weeks in the uh, half-back position. We've Shenton and Nabby ahead of him. Ed Williams, Samuels and Chambers making up the attacking three there. Uh, without further ado, let's get straight into it. So, two substitutes outside the match here, that's fine. FA Cup qualifying round, so is what it is. See where we go. Uh, they're playing quite a wide one. I'm hoping that we can just brush past them because they are a, uh, a sort of low-level team. Right then, so the first highlight goes to Brackley. Um, well then, that was pretty good. Let's just skip over that and pretend that like that didn't happen. We need to uh, demand more after that. In the first 10 minutes that was scored, that's... Uh, how's he got a rating of 8 straight off the bat? It's only 15 minutes in. What's going on here? I'm wondering if it's because our keeper's not very match fit. He's, he's fit, but he's just not match fit. So, and wow, Moyo is a really flagging. So we're going to have to probably look at taking him off uh, at half time. I didn't realise it was that bad. Key flow there with the uh, first goal and uh, from a set piece. That'll do. I like to say that'll do a lot. Sorry, not sorry. Meh. Nah. Is what it is. We'll skip over that because we know that it was a great highlight. Um, <clears throat> we've had, we've been definitely been the better team there. You saw the stats, yes, yeah, seven shots, two shots on target, fifty-seven percent of the uh, possession there. Uh, tell the boys, they're excellent. I I'm not really sure. That's the uh, case. We need to dig in and start uh, going for it. It's a qualifying round to be in, I assume, the first round of the FA Cup. So, digging into, you know, we want to sort of try and get at least second round of the FA Cup. That'd be kind of handy. Um, let's pause it there. Let's go with a tactic change. We're going to bring on... Uh, who can play at... Right back, Lewis Mickey. Oh, there we go. So we'll bring him on. He will be handy over there. We'll bring on Johnson there to make sure the uh, middle's all right. And then we're going to bring on you to try and get something going from the back. So we'll go with support from there. And we'll call that quits. We've done a triple sub. Um, and we will go straight into it. Sorry about that. Add an itchy nose, so I'll just edit that edit that out. Uh. It's still itchy. Mm, not much I can do about that. Uh, we'll go attacking, I guess. Because we do want to win it before the game becomes a, a game coming to our ground. I'd rather win it in the first leg than having to go for a second leg. Nobody likes to play a second leg. So, but it looks like it's going to be that way. Ah, oh, there we go, full time. So we're coming back to our place. Yeah, we'll just tell them it was great if that's what they want to hear. It wasn't great, but it is what it is. All right, then. So, like I say, that was the FA Cup. That wasn't nothing. That was a um, my mistake. That was just a a normal league game. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Right then, this will take us into. Uh, the FA Cup 
third qualifying round. Bear with me. A couple of things to report. So the first thing we've got to report is we've brought in a head of youth development. Uh, ability and potential judging is pretty pretty good for this level. Uh, working with youngsters, not too bad attacking 11 as well. I have made him the overall team coach for the youth team. Uh, fairly professional on the personality, which is always a plus. His reputation is national, uh, national A, so that's always handy. And the board's just allowed me to send him on a coaching course, obviously, to get his national B. So that's national B, or is it? I'm not sure what comes after that. Maybe it's his national B. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, yeah, so there's that. Um, there you go. That There's a confirmation of it. Continental C license is going on. Uh, I've also started a coaching course uh, soon. So that's good. Um, Haynes has just signed a contract because he was on a non-playing contract. Um, and I thought that was probably best for the club. Um in terms of tactics and for the next match, obviously we're going up against Bamber Bridge for the third round qualifying FA Cup. So we've got uh, Mickey O8 on the right, we've got Lowe and Reese Williams in the middle with Dutton ahead of Man Unit in goal. Weeks as a half back again, uh, we've got Shenton with the ball winning midfielder and we're having Haynes run around in a support role, Carolero, because I want to see how he sort of fares up against that if he gets a good Half decent rating, which I'm expecting most of these players to get on this match. Uh, we might try him in that position again and see what happens. And then we've got Ed Williams, Samuels and Chambers ahead in attack. I might actually have a look at putting... No, that's fine. So we might change one of the strikers just to give him a rest about halfway through to see what happens. Hopefully we should be all right. Uh Let's go with what the assistant thinks and uh, we'll get the game underway. So far I've been recording for about 14 minutes, but hopefully this episode's going to be probably about 14 minutes total, hopefully. We'll see. And they've gone 1-0. Let's go attacking, because that was suggested. And we're going to have to ask to show some passion, because if we lose this match, then I'm not going to be too happy. I definitely don't want to see the replay of that. Right then, hopefully this is us uh, hitting straight back then. So Dutton with the throw to Shenton. Shenton gets tackled, however. Williams intercepts and gets the ball moving forward through to Ed Williams. Out on the left, Dutton. Dutton floats it in and Samuels should have done a lot better with that opportunity. I feel that's a really wasted opportunity. And if we get 2-0 two two down here, I think, Things are not going to start looking too good. Williams hoping to get to the ball first. He's running down that right-hand side. He's going to look to... I thought he was going to try and whip it in, but he hasn't. He was throwing, uh, putting a through ball there for Ed Chambers. And Chambers gets tackled, leading us to a corner. Weeks are then delivering the corner with a glancing header that hits the uh, crossbar, as it were. I think it's time to start um, demanding more because this is ridiculous. We can't be going on like this. They're, uh, they're having a pretty damn good game here, although they've just made that epic mistake and Austin Samuels is obviously going to capitalise on that because he, uh, he plays for Kidderminster and that's what we do. So here we are again. Sumner with the uh, throw to Booth who makes a terrible grave mistake and Samuel's like yeah please thanks that'll do me I'll take that uh, so yeah 1-1 one, one, and hopefully we're at home so we need to really start showing a bit more passion if we want to play in this uh, FA Cup because we need a bit of cash the cash goes good cash is king although we're in a pandemic so cash is not king card is king at this point in fact I think from what I remember seeing a video as well that um, the cash is king came from a car salesman where, you know, commission and all that. But even car salesmen nowadays say that the card's king because if they can get you on finance, they can get more money out of you than if you used to pay cash. Uh, Samuels with the ball through to weeks and weeks gets a, a rare goal there. Um, but it was well worked and well deserved. 
We'll see the replay there. So Ed Williams through to Samuels. Samuels slows down, holds up play, puts it through to Declan Weeks, and Weeks slots it home. Nice. Nice bit of hold up play there from uh, Austin Samuels. I apologise. I had some skin sticking off my thumb and it really annoyed me. I had to just take it off. Mikio then with the tackle. Throwing it forward. Samuels on the end of it eventually. And he slots it home. He slots it home. It's weird trying to record these videos because I know there's kids upstairs. I know that Mrs. is trying to sleep. It's like 20 past midnight. The door's not open, so we ain't got the neighbours worrying about listening in. So that's fine. And I've just come off Lelujo's stream. Watching um, his birthday stream. So happy birthday, Lelujo. Hope you had a good one. And that was... A nice follow. That wasn't too bad in all fairness. A good effort. See if this was me, real life. I'd be like, you know, going up to him afterwards and saying, hey, you're not that bad, mate. Not that bad at all. I mean, this guy, for example, 8 to 14 finishing off the balls 11 to 17, which is probably how he got his goal in the first place. But he's 29 years old. That's no good to me, is it? So, so then, so we start looking at substitutions, I think, uh, Dutton with a free kick, doesn't really get anywhere, uh, Dutton's apparently doing some amazing things in training and Samuels has been disallowed a goal from what I would consider a pretty good head to the ball, although, is he offside, he is slightly offside. Although it does, I mean, he drifts back in for the head, but he's already offside, I suppose, by the time it's been hit with the foot. Right then, so we've got Wilson to White and White floats it in, and that's not a bad word goal. Can't really complain about that, but um, I think at this point we need to be looking at taking somebody off. Oh, Ed Williams is injured, so that's not good. I'll tell you what, let's bring on Fuller. Fuller's meant to be okay. So, how old is he? The guy's 19. Let's give this guy a chance. What's his position? What's his actual... Right. So, okay, so... Right. So, that's where he prefers to be, but he's not actually... Right, okay, sure. Sure thing, kiddo. Um, right, let's get Reese Williams off. Put Ryan Johnson on there. Um, and let's get him off for Shenton. And now we can play... What can he play? I play the drum, people. I don't know where that ends up, but there you go. Have some of that. Okay. Well, well done. Great goal. Shout. Demand more. Nabby with some crazy two-footed lunge there. Still didn't get the ball. And Mannion holds on to the ball. All right then, their keeper Rother, Rother with the old kick there. Harry's he's running down this ball. He runs down this wing, all right. To be fair, uh, though we intercept to get it through to Chambers. Chambers over to Weeks. Weeks floats it forward. Sam, uh, Samuel's flicks it onto Fuller. Fuller in with a shout, and he's not been on the pitch too long, and that's not too bad from Fuller. I might be looking at getting Fuller on. A little bit more in the future, if I can, in that advanced playmaker role. Let's see how he holds up. We've got a young striker coming on for their winger, so it looks like they are going. Yeah, they are going three up front now. So they've uh, changed tactic. Hopefully, we can hold them off. They're uh, looking at uninterested. We're going to go show some passion. It fires them up a little bit, and there we go. It's full time with a three-two win over Bamba Bridge, which is tell the boys that did well. And I don't think that's what we should be saying. 
I don't know what happened in the second half. There we go. It 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 was unacceptable, really. We won, but it wasn't really acceptable. Um, right. So we've got an FA Cup fourth qualifying round. Right. Okay. We're not going to come back for that. We're going to try and skip ahead a bit here. So we're going to come back for Kingsley and this FA Trophy third qualifying round, and then we'll uh, see what happens in between there. Okay, guys and girls. And whoever else is watching. Okay, yeah, so we're going to skip with that. Alright then, so if you enjoyed the stream, leave the thumbs up. If you didn't, leave the thumbs down. And if you have any feedback whatsoever, feel free to leave a comment. Leave a comment. This is how we do it. Drop the mic. See you in the next episode.